Hey everyone, so today I'm going to quickly show you how to scrape tweets from Twitter using NA10 and twitterapi.io. So first let me show you the workflow I've built in NA10. As you can see, it's pretty straightforward, but it's actually really powerful. And the magic actually happens through twitterapi.io, uh, which gives you reliable access to Twitter data. And I've included my affiliate link in the video description below. So if you use it instead of uh, the standard 100,000 uh, credits, you will get 500,000 credits and you can actually register for free. So now let me walk you through this workflow. So we start with the trigger. I'm using a manual trigger for this demo, but you could schedule it to run automatically. Then we've got the HTTP request node where we connect to twitterapi.io. So here I've put the URL. You put your API key right there using the name x-api-key. And here you paste your API key, which you will find in your dashboard right there. So you simply copy and paste it right there. Then we've got here the search parameters. So in this example, I'm going to look for SpaceX uh, as a keyword, and I'm going to look for top tweets. You're, you can change this to latest if you want more recent tweets. And right there, we've got a, a pagination system, uh, which allows you to pull more tweets uh, per call. So by default, it's going to pull 20 calls. If you, if you change this to two, for example, so it's going to pull two pages, which will be 40 tweets. I'm going to leave this at one for this example. Then we've got a simple JSON parse node to make the data more usable. So it's taking everything uh, from the API, from the HTTP request, and putting everything uh, in different sections. And then uh, you can do whatever you want with the data. Uh, right there, I'm saving it in a Google Sheet. So uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much about it. Uh, um, I'm going to share with you in the description the template, so you can use it straight away, as well as the code for the this merge item. And uh, right there, uh, you, you will just be able to uh, put every data in the column of your uh, template, which I've built right there. I'm going to share it with you as well. And let me show you exactly how it works. So we're going to test. It's going to trigger, do the HTTP requests merge everything and put everything in the sheet right there. So as you can see, you've got the tweet ID, the URL of the tweet. So here you've got the content of the tweet. We can check if it's the same. Oh, perfect. And you've got the data from the tweets. So the likes count, the retweets count, the replies count, the quotes and the views, and the date it was posted. So yeah. That's about it. Uh, remember to use my affiliate link when uh, signing up to twitterapi.io so you can get uh, 500,000 more credits. And uh, thanks for watching. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions. And uh, see you in the next video. Bye.